Um, it's, I think, uh, the group of people that came together for this first um, festival here are people who are very comfortable with yeah. each other. And I think it gives a very good vibe. I think what makes a festival good many times is the chemistry between mm. the musicians, both musically and also on a human level and yeah. on social level. I think that makes a big diff difference. And uh, in that case, we, I think we communicate quite well both ways, which is fun and special, really. Mm. As been said, I think it's um, the best thing about, about the festival, being able to spend time and play with people that you actually communicate very well with. Um, I think the students get this special vibe as well. I think it's a very supportive environment. I think it's um, a very comfortable environment to study in, to learn, to, to make music, to develop. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think the students um, learn a lot by, by seeing how Basically, we joke around all day long and still um, manage uh, to be very focused in the rehearsal. Clara is, Gary is very good at that, actually. <laughs> it's like when, when <laughs> the, the transition between. <laughs> yeah, between so that you know that it's it's um, during the rehearsal. It's it's very tight because we have so little time to prepare for one concert, two rehearsals at the most, and I think this quick process uh, gives the students. Um, a heads up to what's going to be in the future because you will always be short of time. Yeah, I mean festivals is, is a very unique uh, environment where you have to prepare um, um, everything in a very yeah. short time and you have to get used to it as a young musician mm -hmm. because up till a certain age you're being kind of taught to, with, take, time. to take time and to learn the pieces and to spend sometimes weeks learning pieces and here everything is very very quick and you have to respond very quickly and compromise and compromise sometimes not everything is uh, fully agreed upon <laughs> always <laughs> and uh, being able to take uh, other people's opinions is quite i find quite uh, one challenging. of the most yeah it's one of the most challenging um things about making chamber music and being able to do that is a great i think uh, opportunity to develop as develop. a musician yeah and also as a person also as a person it's true well f for example in one of the rehearsals I was very um, uh, how do you say um, in inspired because of the passion that the students bring it's a kind of you know when we play a different piece every day and we're used to festivals then it's more yeah. you know more focused but maybe not as much as passion as the students bring and i think this is a very good mixture yeah that we get there um, we get inspired by them and they learn some things they haven't yeah it's a mutual of, kind yeah. of a route we both get um, something out of well firstly of course giving is probably the experience that we all have um, and the learning throughout the years what's important and what's uh, to compromise about and um, learning I would say from the students is a lot of what Clara mentioned is this um, keeping this young spirit keeping the fresh freshness of, of music making and um, keep the pieces even a little bit more fresh and I mean um, during my rehearsals um, not only do students uh, inspire me but for example today we had a rehearsal and I had a feeling that I'm learning a lot how to rehearse in a very uh, effective and uh, very effective but focused way from Guy because he is really just not um, throwing away any word he just says something and it has an immediate effect and I could see that the students also understood it very quickly which is also a very good thing as a colleague to learn from to choose carefully yeah. exactly yeah. what you what need you to and what's the most important yeah. thing to say in order to get things together in a certain way in the quickest possible so that's being very efficient <laughs> I think it's a really 
sweet town. The atmosphere is very, I don't know, somehow very calm. Mm. And um, the people seem to be very, very calm nice. yeah. and nice. And it's all very simple. Yeah. I like the simplicity. I actually also saw um, they make very good coffee. Yeah, of course, yeah. it's Spain. Yeah. Come on. That's the place to have good. Cortadissimo. <laughs> <laughs>